so we're here with Crazy Division. If you want to introduce yourself and introduce what you do in the band. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, I'm Tyro, I'm the bassist. I'm I'm Lennon, I'm the drummer. I'm Erin, I'm the singing. Um, I'm Jack and I'm the guitarist. And you're wearing a sick Van Halen t-shirt. Oh yeah, <laughs> I love so, Van Halen. No, fair play, fair play. So you're probably the youngest band we've ever interviewed. You're playing on Good Friday. Mm -hmm. On a lineup with a lot of other young local bands in Milton Keynes. How did you start? Uh, I think the way we started was um, me and Jack started along. I think what was it, three years ago. Yeah. Um, uh, I think it was in year seven, late year seven. Uh, we did a, a club called um, Metalheads. Okay. Um, and uh, we played one show in the venue um, with a few other people. There, but they've they've left school now. They were older than us. And, um, I think when we started in year nine, we were playing GCSE and music. Yeah. Um, Tyrell, we met Tyrell in our music class, and then he he started just playing bass. So um, we thought, oh, we'll form a band. We had a um, we had another singer, and a, he was a guitarist as well. Yeah. Um, he kind of left us. Though, he, he let he left it. He left us. Uh, I think like it was a week before, a, week before, before a, show. a show. Yeah. So oh, it was no. it was a bit a bit thingy. But then, uh, but then the star before. came along. Um, Aaron joined us uh, in November last year. So. It was a divine sign then, the singer went out and yeah. he just yeah. kind of popped up and said, hello. <laughs> Excellent. It's the most craziest way how we met her as well. Yeah. It's from a show we did and basically I met someone in the show and I ended up starting dating them. So of course I was friends with her because she's friends with them. So um, yeah, and then she just randomly said, oh, I can, I can sing. And I was just like, no, man. And then she joined the band. Yeah, so um, here we are now. Oh, fantastic. Yeah. And you've had a busy... Busy year or so. Yeah, yeah we've had um, yeah. we've had a, a few a few shows. We've had um, what was our first one? Our first one was Autumn at the Venue. Autumn at the Venue. Yeah. Um, over about a, we've oh, oh, we haven't done a show here at Brooklyn's before. So yeah, no. this is our first time at Brooklyn's. Our first time oh, okay. yeah. in a show. Um, we've, 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 we've me and Jack have, and Tyro have performed in the venue before, but um, mm -hmm. we have, we haven't performed with Erin in the venue. Yeah. Yeah. So it'll be a it'll be a first for her, but um. We yeah. did just do the battle of the bands. Yeah, we did yeah. do the battle of the bands. We came, we came fourth. fourth. Yeah. So we were, we were only, apparently it was very close between third and fourth. So mm -hmm. competitions yeah. always suggest that yeah, I know. So, you know, don't get too disheartened on that. Yeah. Um. But um. Yeah. And then we did uh, the gig with uh, Debra. You were doing a gig with um, yeah. on the Good Friday, and then um, uh, Nirvana as well. We love Nirvana. Yeah. We're best yeah. friends with them. No, they're good lads. Yeah. Good lads. Very yeah, talented very musicians. Good, but, um, yeah. There you go. Fantastic. So, what's your influences? Obviously, Van Halen. <laughs> so, I'm expecting I'm expecting a rendition of Jump when you play. Yeah, yeah. Show, I jump a lot. I, I'm very excited. Like, I'm like a different person when I'm on the stage. <laughs> like, yeah. Well, I'm still a bit crazy. It's like, crazy. Like, on yeah. <laughs> but um, on stage, I'm just mental. Yeah. Uh, you've, you've got a lot to live up to because I've seen the most jumpy musician going in Kyle from Nerdvana. Yeah. 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 The guy's yeah. like the yeah. Duracell bunny, you can't stop him. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, there we go. Um, I think we've had a, a lot of influences with a lot of bands. My, my favourite band's been ACDC, but my favourite drummer of all time is Danny Carey. Okay. So, um, yeah, I've, I've a bit of, bit of influence from nice. him. Mm -hmm. uh, but yeah, it's just. We've had an influence from a lot of bands. Yeah. To be I love the basses from Metallica, honestly. Especially the way he's on stage and then his signature pose where he goes like that. Mm. Honestly. Whenever I go on stage I try to replicate that. Yeah. So I just try to like put it out there and give them more of a show. Yeah. And yeah. also enjoy it as well. Yeah, well we we were talking the other day with uh was it Lee from Alternative MK the radio show. Mm -hmm. And we said about the the young bands that are coming up, and we said that you, you watch them, and they're so focused on making sure that the music and the sounds right, that it takes time to develop that stagecraft. So the yeah, fact that you're yeah. identifying that, you're watching musicians that you like, and you're saying, right, okay, I'm going to do that because I want the crowd to feed off of me. I think that's brilliant. Mm -hmm. You know, there's so many bands out there in Milton Keynes that, that that's the next step for them is getting that. You know, getting that stagecraft worked down, and you know what we want to try doing going forward is, is getting that. And this is going to sound horrible, so I apologise to all the bands that I know when we work with, the elder or more established bands yeah. that have got that stagecraft, and try seeing if they can start working with some of the younger bands to, mm -hmm. to give them some of that, some of those tips how to, to get the crowd on side and get them warmed off because I, I think you're right. You know, yeah. 
your the people watching the shows they feed off of the bands if you've got someone standing there like a robot the chances are the crowd's going to be yeah. exactly the same yeah yeah so fantastic so go on who's your influences eddie van halen and yeah. um randy rhodes as well they're my oh. favorite yeah um there's a lot i could say like i don't really want to be like a certain artist i want to kind of be myself but still like get a lot of influence from them yeah. i guess so yeah. Fair play. That's the first time I haven't heard Kurt Cobain mention <laughs> an interview. Usually all the bands stand around and just mention about Kurt Cobain and then they go off on a tandem about other other musicians. To hear, to hear Eddie Van Halen and uh, Randy Rhodes. Yeah. Uh, massive Oz fan. So, yeah. how about yourself? Who's your inspiration? Well, there's a lot, but my favourite band would be Arctic Monkeys. But... I admire Freddie Mercury and the way he gets like the crowd going because he just seems to always have fun when he's doing it. So, yeah. Yeah, uh, excellent. Yeah. Uh, excellent. So what's, at the moment, you're predominantly doing covers. Are you starting to write originals as well? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Ah, yeah. are we going to get a taste of any originals on the night? Could do. Probably. Could do. Yeah, could do. Oh, mm -hmm. it's all good. Surprise. Yeah, no, we <laughs> like a bit of suspense and surprise at the shows. Fantastic, fantastic. And just a flavour of what type of covers you're doing at the moment? Uh, a lot, a lot different. We're doing, I don't know, we've done a few Arctic Monkeys songs, yeah. like that kind of style. We've done a few like harder rock kind of... Um, Got Green Day. Yeah, yeah Green, Green Day. Day yeah. Yeah, we, we quite like Green Day. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Nirvana. Nirvana, we like. We've done a few indie songs like Mr. Brightside. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, crowd favourites. Yeah, so mm -hmm. like, songs people would know. Yeah. So that, that would, like, it's another way to get a crowd going. Yeah, like get that interaction you know, singing going along and clapping mm -hmm. along, and it's just what gets the adrenaline going, and then you get yeah. into it. Fantastic. Right now, we're gonna have to get into some serious journalism now. Okay. <laughs> serious journalism. Each of you get to pick three bands to support you on a gig. Who are you picking? They can be dead or alive, don't worry. Any any band. Any band. Uh, for me, it'd be Guns N' Roses, um, Van Halen and uh, Queen. Because they're, like, at the moment, my favourite, so... Yeah. Queen. Definitely, also. <laughs> So this is why we said it's difficult journalism. These are the whole <laughs> questions. Don't we? we're, we're being interviewed by Lee next week on Alternative MK, so we're going to get oh. the hard questions, and I'm going to feel so sorry and guilty <laughs> for every band I've interviewed when I throw this question at them. Uh, mine would be ACDC. They're my favourite band of all the time. Yeah. Um, and then it's got to be... Um, I do love a bit of Slipknot. The double bass shot. Oh, that's my favourite. Um, uh, what else? Uh, prob probably Arctic Monkeys as well. I do love a bit of Arctic Monkeys as well. Okay. For me, definitely Foo Fighters. Honestly, yeah. I love their music. Um, ACDC, definitely. And probably Metallica. Yeah. yeah. So you've got two more bands to pick. <laughs> this Arctic is one. Monkeys. Arctic Monkeys, okay. No, ACDC. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Okay, cool. And you can get rid of one thing in the world. What are you getting rid of? Him. <laughs> 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 position um, opening up. <laughs> um, go on, Jack. What do you think? It's like you can um, say teachers as well. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I have. Thank you. Um... <laughs> I don't know, just coldness in like the weather. Because when I go outside, like my hands get all blue and all that when it's cold. Oh, it hurts. Considering it's spring and we've got what it is outside at the moment, yeah. and I've got the big winter jacket on and the hoodie. I'm fully behind you on that. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay, fair play. Oh, um, I don't know. Uh, it's got to be classical music. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I do not like classical music. Yeah, but you wouldn't, have, you wouldn't have rock music if it weren't for, for classical I understand that, but I 
can't stand classical music. And like, yeah, but Gun Hoven was the motley crew of his day. But there's no, there's no um, to it. There's no like power to it. I don't understand it. Yeah, I don't know. I don't, you're, you're a music teacher. What's, what's the one where you usually get the cliche of the, the rich spinster millionaire sitting in his chair with a massive speaker in front of him? Wagner's. Oh, the Ride of the Valkyries? Yeah, Ride of the Valkyries. That's pretty uplifting. That's pretty, you know. It depends. What kind? Of, what? I... Yeah, all right. Okay. That's it, all right. You don't the... have to change your mind. If you it want to get rid of it, it can go in the bin. Don't worry. There are more things. More things that I don't want to say. But... <laughs> <laughs> uh... I don't know. I'll go with her, then. Okay, so that's two of you out <laughs> of the band now, so... <laughs> Um, I'm being honest, it's like, probably like, when you get that, like, hurt in your hand from playing the bass too long. Yeah. Like, that would be what, one thing I just love to get rid of, so I just play endlessly. That Fair would be it, yeah. You should check out a band, Ice T's band, uh, Body Count. It's Body Count, isn't it? Totally You're like the bass player now. I saw him play uh, Download, and the bass player played so hard that when he came off stage, the <laughs> strings were just covered in blood, and his fingers were ripped open. Oh wow! And that it's just how heavy and hard they play, and how fast they play as a band. But yeah, no, they're a good band, very good band. So, what's the future plans? What gigs have you got lined uh, up? We have. Um, Blue, Wolf. Blue, yeah. We've got. Uh, we've got, well, got one with the Debris on the Good Friday. We've got. Um, Two at, at a school in two days um, on the 9th and the 10th of J- July. Yeah, July. July, yeah. yeah. Um, that's at Wagner Gate and Heron's, Heron's Gate. Gate. Oh, okay. um, we're playing there and then, uh, uh, but do you know Blue Wall? Have you heard we, of Blue we Wall? do, we've got them booked for an event that we're doing at the Broughton Hotel. Yeah, we're, they're, we're playing with them. Uh, we're playing with them for one of the school gigs, and then we've got a gig there doing their own gig. Okay. And uh, they've asked us to play with them. Oh, fantastic! Uh, it's at the Blacksmith's Arms. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Newport yeah. Pagnell. Uh, I think it's Newport Pagnell. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Newport Pagnell. Pagnell. Downhead Park. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um. Uh. But yeah, we're looking forward to it, yeah. and we're hoping to get some more. Fantastic! We'll tell the promoters. Hoping to get, get some more. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's um. So big plans for the future. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. EP big releases. Yeah. World yeah. domination. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> All for it. All for it. Yeah. All for it. Excellent. Excellent. Now that's brilliant. We're well. We're really looking forward to having you play. Cheers. Do you know much about the other bands that are on with you? Uh, we we know Debris. Yeah. yeah. We, we do like Debris. Debris are very good. Um, we don't know. I don't. I don't think we know the other two. Mm-hmm. Um, so you've got the Bronze. We, are we, I've heard of them. I've heard of both of them, but I haven't, I haven't watched them play yet. No, the Bronze are good. They they played our show in February, and that was their, their first proper show yeah. that they played. And, yeah, they, they absolutely smashed it. Yeah. They opened the show, and they had 50 people in the crowd <laughs> going nuts, which um. is unheard of, absolutely unheard of. So, you know, you're obviously going to smash that. Yeah. yeah. Clearly expecting 60 people just to turn up as a minimum for <laughs> <laughs> So there's no problems there, and uh, yeah, you got a message for anyone out there? Any Support fans? us, rock on! Yeah, rock on. yeah. <laughs> Just stay tuned. Crazy divisions will be a household name soon. Excellent. No, it's been a pleasure. Really Cheers. Thank you very much for being here. Thank you very much. No Have a nice. This is not a dream.